Everton, no win in 43 games, a minus 5% win record as manager, but today Al Etifak have given you a new contract and made you the highest paid manager in football history. How are you feeling? Of course. Look, today is a really, really emotional day uh, for me and my bank manager. Um, it's been really worrying the last couple of weeks. I've been wondering uh, whether or not I'd be able to keep my head above the water. Uh, worrying whether I could put the down payments on the space shuttle I ordered last week, and um, and I'm struggling to pay the mortgages on the on the properties I own on 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 Mars. Um, it's been really difficult to be fair, really difficult. But today waking up and looking at my bank balance and seeing 45 zeros instead of only 31, it's a game changer for me. Um, and it means I can put bread on the table for my family, uh, so it's a really emotional day. Stephen, you're a wealthy man. Wouldn't you rather have a respectful managerial career instead of selling your soul for an extra couple of quid? Yeah, of course. Look, people seem to think that, you know, having loads of money makes you happy, but it really doesn't, to be fair. Um, it's been really difficult for me, actually. Um, yeah, I'm on 41 grand a day, but in Saudi Arabia, after tax, that's only 350 grand a day. Um, and having too much money, it can make you really tired. Having to count it every day all the time, I'm getting really tired. Um, I've had to move three of the private jets onto me, me pathway uh, to make room for the cash in the house. and It's just really tiring, but no one will seem to mention that. Um, they really won't, and um, it can be really, really tough. Yeah, of course. Stephen, you have lost some very important players. Uh, have you spoke to the Al Etifaki chairman about bringing some new signings in? Yeah. Of course, look, I spoke to the Aleti Fach, Wach, Wach, whatever they're called, chairman, um, this morning and said, give me some more dough. Um, but he told me he's slightly worried about giving me more, more money. Uh, the last time he gave me a couple of hundred million quid, I uh, came back with a 67 year old donkey uh, from Liverpool who couldn't pa pass a ball forwards more than five yards. And I spent the rest of the money on hair wax to keep me fringe in the same position that it's been in for 25 years. So I can understand why he's slightly worried about giving me more dough. Yeah, cool. Well, he really was a massive signing, so just how angry and upset were the fans to see Jordan Henderson sold to Ajax? Yeah, of course. Look, the fans weren't bothered. Uh, obviously, they've seen him play, so uh, they weren't bothered to see him go. Um, they all turned up at the airport to wave him goodbye, uh, all five of them. Um, and to be fair, we didn't sell much um, Jordan Henderson merchandise in the club shop. Yeah, apart from one cardboard cutout, uh, which to be honest with you, I bought and I played it in midfield last night and it's already scored more goals than the actual real Jordan Henderson and the cardboard cutout is actually Al Etifaki Wachwach's best player and player of the season probably so far. Yeah, of course. Oh, I know it was your dream, but I think we can safely say there is absolutely no way you will ever manage your beloved Liverpool now, Stephen. Yeah, of course, look, people think I'm really stupid, don't they? Uh, but while I've been in Saudi Arabia, I've made £700 billion. Um, I've spoke to FSG and I've agreed a deal to buy Liverpool. The first thing I'm going to do is sack Jürgen Klopp, make myself the new gaffer and take us straight down to the championship. Look, it was my plan all along, it really was. Um, and people think I'm stupid. Yeah, of course. And, uh, Stephen, finally, just how long... Is this new Al Etifak Wak Waki Wak Wak contract for? Yes, my new deal with Al Etifak Wak Wak, whatever they're called, um, is a new two year extension. Uh, so that will take keep me at Al Etifak till 2001, um, next week after we get absolutely smashed 8 0 at home by Al Pacino. Yeah, of course.